what's up guys welcome back to our youtube channel so yeah if you are new to this channel or a retainer uh, we have not yet subscribed uh, kindly support by just pressing that red button and also don't forget to click on the notification bell icon uh, for you to be notified when every time i post a uh, new videos let's grow this uh, channel together so today i'm back with the booming crash strategy and uh, it works both when you are trading spikes and uh, when you are trading ticks so uh, let me just show you how do you set these indicators with the parabolic with the parabolic just a uh, copy as it is on the parabolic after copying the new press uh, done we have the Bollinger uh, bands just copy as it is press down this is our main charts okay so let's go to the uh, indicator window one on the indicator window one with the relative trend index after copying this uh, we have also the levels don't forget to uh, write this on your description okay after uh, copying the relative you press down we have the envelopes copy as it is press down with the each mock just copy and then after copying you press down with the moving average okay after copying you press down here so after putting all your indicators your chart must look like this it must look like this so one rule for this strategy is uh, it works only when we are using a uh, five minutes time frame that is where it is more accurate so another thing on time frame uh, we have to use the second zoom in this one but so let me just show you how the strategy works you better pay attention because it, this information is very important this information is very important so on our main chart we have the the parabolic and the bollinger uh, bands okay so what happens is each each and every time when we are uh, trading using this parabolic and the bollinger bands on your main chart it must uh, form this second leg okay it must form this second leg each and every time when you are looking for a selling opportunity it must form on this resistance and then when we are buying it must form a second leg on support making it a double top and a double bottom okay this is the first thing that you check uh, when you are trading using this strategy okay as i've said we use the second zoom okay so uh, on the main i mean on the second indicator window we have the uh, rsi relative trend index which is the levels 15 uh, 50 and 85 this is the rsi and then we have the envelope which is the one with black the one with black right here is the envelope and then we have the each mock the each mock the one which green here. and we have the moving average the blue one so how does this strategy work? First thing is each and every time after the uh, after this indicators on main chart formed the, the double bottom or the double top. Uh, second thing you go on your second indicator window one and first thing you need to check is the is the each mock. It must come for the first time. After coming for the first time, uh, you need to wait for the market okay you don't have to rush you need to wait for the market to come for the second time making it a double bottom and on the second time that's when you end okay that's when you end your moving average and your envelope must be in line with this with this parabolic and the uh, bollinger bands it must be in line with this okay so after all this happens you enter your buy 
remember as i've highlighted here you only buy between 0 to 15 level between 0 to 15 level that's when you you buy so if the market comes comes out of this zone okay let's say it's right here uh, you have to wait, wait for another uh, setup okay you only buy in this zone that's the zone where you buy same applies when you are selling uh, this uh, parabolic and the Polynesia bands must form first leg and then the second after forming the second leg you come here on your second indicator window one you check your uh, Ichimoku it must come forming the first leg in this uh, 85 to 100 zone after the Ichimoku you have to be patient and then wait for the uh, moving average and the envelope to come and then after coming in this 85 to 100 zone it must be in line with the uh, parabolic and the bollinger bands that's when you sell you see what happened after all the confirmation he started selling after the after all the confirmations you see he started buying so on crash uh, when we are buying you will be trading ticks and then when we are selling you will be a uh, trading spikes as i've said earlier uh, this strategy works both when we are trading ticks or uh, when we are catching spikes okay so this is how the strategy works guys you only need to practice and master it 